All right, Gary, thank you so much. As you can imagine, the Rocky Ford cantaloupes, cantaloupes are so hot right now. They're hot at the farmer's markets, one of my favorites. So this morning, one of our five Pillsbury Bake Off contestants in the state, Jackie Karyosha, is joining us this morning with some awesome cantaloupe recipe. It's a breakfast recipe. Before we get to that real quick, just tell us, you know, where can you find the best deals on cantaloupes right now? You know, any of the farmer's markets, like you mentioned, but even some of your local grocery stores have great deals on Rocky Ford cantaloupe this week. Okay. So with cantaloupe, you Usually, I will try to smell it or like press this thing. Is that right? Smelling is one of the top keys in finding a fresh cantaloupe. It'll have that slightly fruity floral smell, but not overpowering so. A couple of the other tips is that if you look at the rind underneath the webbing, it'll start to turn yellow instead of the green gray. So yellow is good. Yellow is good. Oh, very interesting. So is pushing the end of it, is that true too? That is true too. And then a couple other tips are if it feels heavy for its size, that's a sign that it, it's a good cantaloupe. Oh, good to know. I love that. All right, so how did you come up with this recipe? Well, I wanted to keep it simple since the Rocky Ford cantaloupe is so delicious. Mm -hmm. I really wanted to showcase the cantaloupe. Okay. And what I've done is I, I called this cantaloupe carpaccio, and carpaccio just means thinly sliced rare meats. Okay. So kind of using it loosely here. Okay. And you can cut this using a knife, but I find a mandolin or deli slicer is even better, so it's see, nice and thin. How thin that is. I don't know if yeah. you can get a good close-up of that, but it's really thin. And then what I'm going to do to layer the sandwich, I've just taken a croissant and cut it in half. I'm going to put on a couple tablespoons of a Greek style vanilla flavored yogurt so it's nice and thick. And I've put a little bit of the zest from an orange in the, the yogurt to add some flavor. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to just sprinkle on a little bit of walnuts and some fresh blueberries. This sounds pretty healthy. It is really healthy. And then you just layer on as much of the cantaloupe as you like and with it thinly sliced. So in my whole, case, the whole cantaloupe. Pretty much. <laughs> and I've, done, I've taken half a cantaloupe for this recipe and put it in a marinade of some orange juice and honey for about an hour just to enhance the flavor. Okay. And that's and what it, this is? This a marinade? That's it. This is a marinade. Just the orange juice and the honey. Okay. And pour it over your cantaloupe. And, and that's it. You have a nice sandwich that you can eat for breakfast. That looks delicious. That's fantastic. Um, so as always, where can people find out where those farmer's markets are? The USDA has a great website that you can search for by zip, zip code and coloradofarmers.org also has a great list. That is fantastic. Jake, Jackie, thank you so much. Really appreciate it. Of course, no we problem. always put these recipes on our website at 9news.com. Gary? I love cantaloupe. That is great. All right.